All right, you guys, we're back on the pool project here for one more day until plumbing, hopefully. Uh, we got two in skimmers to install, three returns, three lights, and, uh, and then we got some backfill to finish up here. Um, but other than that, uh, we're looking good. We do have to do another lift here, so I want it to where I have all the plumbing done and then we can finish it up. So we're going to go ahead and set a time lapse up here and, and uh, get to work. Four and three eighths. All right, go to the corner. Four and a half. All right, give it three pumps on that jack. So when we're doing this on the jack, we're uh, you got to look at the bottom of the shell because when you jack it up, it, it will stretch the shell just a little bit. Um, so you got to really look underneath of it, and so we'll go a little high. So when we drop it down, it settles. But sometimes we may go just like an eighth inch higher. We'll, we'll pack it, settle it, drop it, measure again. A lot of times it'll settle back like lower. So then we re-jack it again, pack it again. Um, but that way, you know, you're not getting to the point where it's too much, you know, where like you overcompensated. So now 34 and 5 eighths plus. Like six inches underneath. No, you can't, it's too thin. There's not enough um, space. I mean, gravel's a quarter inch. You know what I mean? Like you're not gonna get that much room. Because I'm going an eighth inch higher than I than we're supposed to be, packing it, letting it settle, and then we'll see where it's at. Rejack it up. You know, do the same exact thing, and then uh, we got it. Alrighty, shell is level. I want to say something, whatever platform I'm on here, build show, my YouTube channel, vlog, training series, I've got content going everywhere that's used all in the same place, that's filmed in the same place. And I want to say that we got this shell, so I'm going to point something out that you won't hear from anybody else, and it's just the reality of it. But I, I like the transparency and I'm not afraid to show either mistakes or wins on YouTube or on Facebook, the internet in general. So, what I'm really referring to is the levelness of the shell. Um, the industry standard is two inches. As crazy as that sounds, it's two inches. You can see the water's coming up just about perfectly all around. And you're gonna have some variances on the ends of the seats and then the bench because these kind of, con uh, they slope in a lot of times. So, but what we have here we measured from our stand over there 34 and a quarter plus it's 34 and a quarter plus we jacked this up only a quarter inch now i've stated in my uh some other videos we only do a quarter to a half now on our lifts because anything more than that any more than three quarter or so you have problems with the shell in the middle so we only jack up a little bit if not we have if it's really bad we'll come back and fix it as we're setting the shell but we lifted it up a quarter inch, so now we're at a quarter plus here. We're at a quarter plus here. And in the center there, we are at 34 and 3 16 And uh, over there is a quarter plus as well. So this shell is what we consider perfect. And there's an eighth inch variance on this shell specifically. And so I point all these details out to people to show what the reality of pool building is for us. This is our reality. Other people's reality is different. I just want to showcase what we do and the work that we do and show that we are proud of what we do. And so when you're proud of something, you can show this great level of detail. And that's this whole channel across all my platforms here. 
is the detail and we want to show customers show fans show the world this is how we do it and um, we are always looking for better ways to improve and to get better what we do um, and we're not afraid to expose ourselves because once you expose yourself you're opening up the door for learning and for growth and that's what we're about here so just wanted to point that out to you guys center is 12 foot Imagine you do anything to this. This is just literally like you know, whatever it is, you're thing. Alright gang, we just got the skimmers installed. Two skimmers, the size the doctor requested. Turns are all done. Trains or turns and lights are all done. Um, this thing is gonna light up like a Christmas tree. We got three lights in here. So it's gonna look really nice. But we're gonna go ahead and shut this water off. This thing is ready for plumbing. Jesus is going to do it Friday, both of them. Um, we're going to go ahead and dig this trench, and then we're going to head over to the uh, to the next pool. Yeah, it shouldn't be a problem. So we're going to do I don't know what, like 16 inches. Right? Yeah. Let's it's gonna be the drain, skimmer, skimmer. All right, so we will run the conduits like, he needs to be able to put a box on them. That's fine. Yeah, we're looking good. Um, yeah, drain skimmers. Okay, perfect. We're out of this dump. 